reverse composite functions. So if we see something like given fg of x, find f of x. In this video, we're going to refer whatever the outer function as our front functions. Meanwhile, we will refer whatever the inner function as our back functions. So they are also known as outer and inner functions. So remember, we refer the one here is front, this is back. So first, we're going to see that how can we find the front functions by using a simple way where we call it as a fish. Fish. F-I-S-H. So it means that whenever they ask us to find the front functions, we use the way of fish. So how we do is, first, we verify first whether they are finding the front functions. Once we done verify, we're going to inverse the normal functions. So once we inverse the normal functions, we're going to substitute our answer from the number two into the composite functions. After that, we are done. That's why you feel very happy. So let us see the question now. So f g of x is equivalent to 2x plus 5, g of x is x minus 3, and that asks us to find f x. So what is our fish method again? First, verify first whether they are finding the front functions. So we know they're asking to find f, so it's at the front. So done verify, we go for second step, it's inverse. So what do we inverse? We are inverse the normal functions. So this is our normal functions, we're going to do the inverse. So remember how to do the inverse? Learn it yourself. So we're going to let y is equivalent to the functions. Interchange the x and y. Then after that, look for y. The y is x plus 3. So this will be my inverse functions. Then we are done for second step. So this is how you do. If you don't know how to do it, you can look back at the video that we posted before. Next, we're going to do the S. S means substitute. So how do we substitute? We substitute our answer into the composite functions. So as we know, this is our composite functions. So how do we substitute in? We substitute this one into the X. So I will know that our FX is equivalent to 2 substitute in substitute in what? the answer that we found just now so we expand it 2 times x 2x 2, 2 times 3 6 plus 5 so this is how we get 2x plus 11 for fx once we have this one we are done step number 2 number two, 1 2 and 3 we are done so we have the answer now we feel happy so this is how you do finding the front functions. How about now we are finding the function at the back. So given fg of x, finding gx, g of x. So can you see that? This is at the back. So how do we do? We are using the method of b as c. b as c, be super crazy. Or in Malay, we say bapa sangat chomel. So how do we do? Let's see the question now. Given fg of x is 2x plus 5, f of x is 2x plus 11. Finding g of x. So the first step is bsc. Bapak sangat chomel. Be super crazy. So b is verify first. Whether they are finding the back function. So yes, gx is located at the back. So we can now proceed to the second step. So what do the second step is telling us is substitute. So where do we substitute? We substitute whatever that we want to find into the normal functions. We substitute whatever that we want to find into the normal functions. So which one is the normal function? This one. So what do we want to find? We want to find gx. So we substitute all of our x become gx. So we have now 2gx plus 11. So why do we want to do like this is because Although they tell us fg of x is this one, we don't believe. We want to try to do our surf. So how do we do? Now, this is our own version of fg of x. Can you see that? This is what we did by our surf. And this is what they given to us. 
So BS, C, super crazy, sangat comel. So C is going to be compare. How do we compare? Since this is the one that we find it up by our surf, this is FG of X, this is also FG of X. So basically they are the same, so we just need to compare. So we put it side by side to compare. So when we compare, we see that this is supposed to be equivalent to this. So we see that 2GX plus 11 must be equivalent to 2X plus 5. Since we are looking at GX, so we move everything is not necessary to the right hand side. Plus 11 become minus 11. So what should we do next now? So we have GX is equivalent to, if you do the mathematics, plus 5 minus 11, 2X minus 6. When you are together, it's the times go over there, become divide. So if you want to simplify, 2 divided by 2 is 1. Negative 6 divided by 2 is negative 3. So we can say that GX is equivalent to X minus 3. So this is how you find the back functions. So this is the neat solutions and done. This is how we reverse the composite functions. Hey, if you have any questions or would like to see any kind of video, do leave your comments below and let me know. If you want to support us so that we could make more video like this, the simplest way is just by sharing the video with your friends. Click the like buttons and consider subscribe to this channel. See you in the next video.